Hi, everybody. Um, as we close out 2020, many of us will probably uh, sing a song that some people may not know all the words to and might go la 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 during parts of it. Uh, so we thought we'd do a special video here to help you sing out the old year and in the new year. Um, there are lots of traditions through many different cultures. Um, I know for uh, the Irish tradition, which will make Mrs. Southern really happy, it's to open a door. Open your front door to let out the old year at midnight and let the new year in. And for many people I know, I think they're going to open the doors, the windows, garage doors, everything to let this old year out and welcome in the new year. So I thought we'd help you with the song Auld Lang Syne. And those words are actually the Scots language. They come from Scotland. And Auld Lang Syne means old, long since. So like long, long ago or in days gone by. And this is actually a poem from 1788. And it's set to a traditional Scottish tune. Um, it bids farewell to the old year and welcomes in the new year. Um, so here are the words for you to help you. Should old acquaintance be forgot, so the people that we knew in the past, should old acquaintance be forgot and never brought to mind? And there's a question mark there. So it's not saying you should forget about these people. It's saying should we really forget about all of these people in our past or should we still hold them close? Should old acquaintance be forgot and never brought to mind? Should old acquaintance be forgot and old lang syne? Should we forget about our past year? No, because that helps make us who we are. So we shouldn't forget about the people in our past and we shouldn't forget about the years gone by because those are what make us who we are. That's who forms us. For old lang syne, my dear, for old lang syne, we'll take a cup of kindness yet for old lang syne. So we still remember the past year and we, as we welcome the new year. So that's what this whole poem means. Don't forget the past. Don't forget the people in your past as you look to the future. So here is a little bit of it sung for you. I'll do a phrase and then we'll do it together. Oh
will sing this song as you usher out 2020 and welcome in 2021 while remembering all the relationships, all the things that have happened to you in 2020, good or bad, those are what make us who we are. So here's Auld Lang Syne for you. 